These we're, are giant left-wing lies. We're talking about degrees. To say that men can menstruate is a lie. And that is now, that is what is said. Yeah, wait, 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 where did that I, come from? I never wait, you never heard it, right? Okay, check it out, folks. Check it out. Anyone who says a man cannot menstruate is considered transphobic. I, I, I missed this whole story. You, you did? I did. I agree tell, you did. tell me where, so where, where are you getting it. this? Just Google it. Can men menstruate? Who, who is saying this? You're who talking saying about a very small no, percentage. Oh, really? Then how do you allow men, biological men, to run against women in, in the races in Connecticut and set all the high oh, school oh, records? Okay, I, but that's... Oh, they're, they're called men. No, no. The Nation See, magazine I wouldn't, said they're, they're, okay, they're women. Okay, but I would agree with you on that. The way you frame it is nonsense. In just three years, Dennis Prager's words went from right-wing conspiracy theory to a pinnacle tenet of every single medical institution, government agency, educational institution, and corporate office. This is a slippery slope at work, guys.